Hey guys, welcome back to the Plus Ultra Fitness Podcast. There will be no character analysis episode this week. We will be having another one next week. This week, I'm going to be doing a very quick, very brief recap on the month. And I want to just start by saying thank you, because this month has been the best month for downloads across all the podcast platforms, as well as the best month for YouTube views that we've ever had as a podcast. And, you know, I'm really happy that the podcast continues to grow and it's thank you to you guys, listeners. So if you're a new listener, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for coming. Thank you for finding the podcast. And I hope you are enjoying the podcast so far from the few episodes you've maybe listened to. And if you guys have been around for a while, thank you for your continued support. Thank you for continuing to listen. I really appreciate it. And I want to keep putting out more episodes. And when I see so many people like tuning in and watching and listening, it makes me really happy. It shows me that, um, you know, things are growing and things are going in the right direction. And that, you know, I'm not just putting in all this work for nobody to listen to. And I would probably do that anyways, because it's fun for me, but it's nice when some of the messages I've been trying to put out are reaching more people and helping people in the way that I intend for them to help people. So with that said, I want to just throw some things by you guys. So on podcast platforms, we had 388 downloads this month. So that is like by far the highest. I think the most uh, we've had in a month prior to this was about 280, 290 something. So just short of the 300 mark, this is the first month that we went over the 300 mark and we've like absolutely blown past it with uh, this episode as well as one more episode left for the month. Um, So I'm really excited to see where we end up. I would imagine that we will surpass 400 this month. And that makes me really excited. Now talking about surpassing 400, Um, YouTube has absolutely demolished that number with 437 views and still growing. Um, So thank you for everybody who's listening on YouTube. Traditionally, the podcast has been um, not as high for views on YouTube as it has been on podcast platforms. So the fact that it's growing on YouTube um, definitely makes me happy. And maybe I'll try to do a little bit more with some of the YouTube stuff, but I'm glad that you guys are enjoying seeing my, my face and the face of the guests I'm bringing on and, uh, you know, joining in on watching the, the video on YouTube. And With that said, if you guys aren't already subscribed, please throw a like and a subscribe on the channel. I would really appreciate seeing that subscriber go number go up a little bit, um, especially with all the views coming in. But, um, you know, even if you don't subscribe, thank you for listening. I appreciate it. So the number one episode on the podcast platforms this month was the episode that me, Zach, and Evan did about body image and body dysmorphia. So if you guys haven't given that episode a listen, it's a really good listener watch. Please, please, please go give it a listener watch. Um, It's something that I've wanted to talk about for a while, but it's a message that I hugely wanted to spread because I think a lot of men especially, but you know, people in general struggle with body dysmorphia. They struggle with this idea of society tells us we have to look one way and that's just the way we have to look. There's no, we're not allowed to look how we want to look, I guess, in a way. And we start to create unrealistic expectations of ourselves because society tells us we have to look a certain way in order to be accepted. But that way that we have to look, it is a way that you can't really look daily because the people that look like that, the images that they're showing us are people that have been airbrushed, people that have been edited, um, people that have, are you know flexing and posing and using the right angles, they're using the right um, lighting, and they're typically dieting down to look like that for one day and doing some type of water cut. So A, if you're not doing all that stuff, You can't expect to look like that. If that's one of your goals is to do that and look like that for a certain competition or photo shoot or something like that, that's a perfectly good goal to have as long as you have that expectation that, you know, you're going to look like that for that event 
and you're not going to look like that after. And that's okay because, you know, even the people that are portraying those images don't look like that on the daily and they don't look like that from every angle. And I know so many people that are so hard on themselves because they look at themselves in a certain light or a certain angle. And they're like, I don't look like that. And that's not okay. It's like, well, even those people don't look like that from every angle. And with that said, like, however you want to look, you're allowed to look that way. There's no pressure, you know, there, there doesn't have to be that pressure that you have to look a certain way. If you want to look a certain way, that's a perfectly cool goal for you, but you don't have to, you can look however you want to look and you can still be happy with yourself and, you know, health and fitness, you know, despite what many people think isn't about looking a certain way, it's about becoming a better version of yourself and being a better version of yourself going plus ultra, you might say, to get a little corny on you guys there. So don't feel that pressure. And I guess go listen to the episode if you haven't already. But thank you guys for making that the most listened to episode across podcast platforms. That makes me really happy. And the most listened to slash viewed episode across YouTube was having your squads back. Um, my episode with the one, the only Kyle, the shadow Hokage within the Just Saiyan community. So I'm so happy this episode has like absolutely blown up. So for any of you guys that have um, listened to, you know, Kyle's episode, and that's how you guys have kind of found the podcast or found the channel. Thank you. He's such a good dude. It was made me so happy to bring him on. Um, we had such a fun, such a good episode, and I just think there's so many good points there. So, um, Kyle, if you're listening, thank you for coming on. And if you are somebody that's here because of Kyle, thank you for being here. I really appreciate it. Now, like I said, there's going to be one last episode this month for the podcast. It is going to be a Q&A episode done. Uh, it'll come out on Monday. I'll be recording it on Sunday. So if you're listening to this before Sunday, May 30th, um, message me any questions you guys have on Instagram at Max Hall Fitness or on the podcast at the Plus Ultra Fitness Podcast. Or um, go if you have me on Facebook, go ahead and I put a comment on there or a post on there for people to ask questions. Um, give me your guys's questions about, you know, the podcast, about anime, about fitness, about some cool stuff in between. I really want to have a fun episode just sitting here and answering your guys's questions. So thank you so much for listening. I really appreciate it. Have yourselves a plus ultra day. And if you're not already part of the discord, go to the link in either my personal Instagram's bio or the podcast bio, click the link in the bio and jump into the discord. Um, we have a lot of fun at the UA Academy discord. Um, it's a really fun place to connect with a lot of other people that love anime and fitness. It's not necessarily about, um, you know, plugging the podcast. It's just about being a community for people to um, find other like-minded individuals and make some friends. So take care, guys. See you later.